That's right, Craig. Republican Senator Tom Cotton was in the meeting with President Trump, along with Senators Durbin and Graham and many others, when the conversation shifted to immigration. Today, they, along with other members of our delegation, reacted to these allegations. Today, Senator Cotton released a joint statement with Georgia Senator David Perdue, reading in part, quote, We do not recall the president saying these comments specifically, but what he did call out was the imbalance in our current immigration system. Representative Steve Womack was in our area today, and we spoke exclusively to him about the allegations, and he says that he tries to look past the president's words and find their meaning. If you're only appealing to people from countries uh, that are uh, behind the times, uh, de depraved countries, if, if that's the, the element that you are appealing to, then he feels like that we should make this, the same or a better appeal to people from other European countries, etc., that uh, can come in here and actually uh, fit into the society as we know it. Senator Bozeman was not in the meeting, but spoke highly of immigrants in America, saying in part, our country is made of immigrants. This diversity is what makes our country great and something all citizens should be proud of. Governor Asa Hutchinson tells 4029 he is focused on the international perception of America during these kinds of situations. We want to be a welcoming nation and we want to send signals that are consistent with that. Uh, we value uh, immigrants uh, that come here lawfully. We're a welcoming nation. We always have been, and we want to make sure that message uh, goes out. Now, Senators Cotton, Purdue, and Durbin are the only ones so far to comment on what was said in that meeting. Alex Wilson, 4029 News.